What's going on guys? Um, I got a package here and I don't know what's in it. Um, Ian had this sent to me. I don't know anything about it. He just asked me to record my reaction to it when I opened the box. So I'm assuming it's something I probably haven't seen before. I have no idea. Um, just to speculate, it could be, gosh, it could be a few things. It could be a Hales, I mean, I, I've seen Hales. Um, it could be a scope of some sort. Maybe a Hensolt, I've seen those though. I don't know. It seems a little long to be like a flash, like a, I guess it, you could put like an MPP in there that has plenty of space though. They're only about that long. I don't know. Let's open it up and uh, see what is in here. So, uh, figure out this mystery, mystery box. This is not mine as far as I'm aware. I don't recall buying anything. Oh no, wait a minute. I can see the receipt. I know what that is. I know what that is. <laughs> oh, snap. Oh, man. That's a compact. Two and a half, the, the right one. The, geez. Okay. And then there's, there's not just one, there's two. But this one's the same as what I have, I believe. Yeah, 4X. Oh my gosh. Don't need that. Or that. This, the, the, <laughs> it was spoiled because this receipt was sitting on the top and I could see, I could see it. I don't know if that's gonna focus on it or not, but uh, I could see Compact Super 4 by 51 and Compact Super, Super 2 and a half by 20. Just sitting there right on the top. <laughs> I mean, I have one of these already. It's super cool. Um, and I've discovered that all you gotta do to make it look a lot more like the, the two and a half is you can just unscrew this guy. And you can see how it's separating. And you basically just unscrew it. it takes a minute because it's kind of got a lot of threads. The downside is you don't have a front lens and a ring, um, so you'd have to source it from something else or just go without. Um, but yeah, look at that. It's a lot closer. It just needs that little, I don't know, three-eighths of an inch ring on the end, really, and it's super, super close. Oh, man. Super two and a half. Good clear optics. It's a little dirty, but like uh, on the lens there, but that can be cleaned pretty easily. Just a little bit of dust little bit of smudginess on this side. Possibly a scratch. I don't know if that'll come off or not. But it's not really that important for what we do with them. We build Greedo Killers with them. Let me put this back on. Maybe. That's really cool. Um, it's finally finally getting to see the real one. It's always nice to see the exact correct part, you know, every once in a while. To know they actually exist because these things are so friggin' rare. You know, it's like... I've seen a total of, what, three of these now? Two of them are the 4X, and this is the only real correct version. So, wow. 
yeah, let me get some cool uh, close-up shots of this um, for you guys to to salivate over. 